Hi, I'm Pat Fleming. AccuStats Video Production has produced hundreds of videos over the years, and now we're introducing our first instructional video, The Creative Edge. This video won't tell you how to stand at the table, make a bridge, nor follow through, but to appreciate this video, you will have to know these basic skills. But regardless of whether you've acquired good or bad habits in these areas, all of the strategies and techniques in this video will work for you. The intent of this video is to open your mind to other options, different ways of approaching shots and situations. We'll talk about creative safety play and what to look for in a nine ball rack. We'll also discuss creative position play and what to look for in a straight pool break shot. And now, the creative edge. There's safety play and there's creative safety play. In this instance, my opponent scratched on the break, giving me ball in hand. We do have some problems. We have a small cluster here, which has the three ball in it, and a small cluster here. You should consider playing safety. One of the most accurate ways of playing safety is with the straight draw shot. What I'm going to do here is, with cue ball in hand, position my cue ball so that I can draw straight back and draw this cue ball behind this cluster. The straight draw is much more accurate than following or drawing on an angle. So consider the safety draw. Another creative safety is the double kiss safety. When the object ball is on or near the rail, let's say up to a half an inch, you can employ the double kiss safety. What you must do is apply draw on the cue ball. Make sure that the cue ball is still spinning backwards when it strikes the object ball. Very effective safety. The two key elements of this shot are Number one, to make sure that the cue ball is not rolling forward when it strikes the object ball. And number two, to make sure that the cue ball always strikes the object ball directly opposite the cushion, in this case, dead center. Another version of the double kiss safety is when the cue ball and object ball are at an angle. We actually hit the same point on the object ball as we did before which is directly opposite the cushion. What this does is, after the double kiss, the cue ball leaves the area in a similar angle. Remember, once again, you must hit this cue ball below center and make sure that the cue ball is spinning backwards when it strikes the object ball. Let's look at some other versions of the double kiss safety. And yet another version of the double kiss safety is when the cue ball strikes the object ball slightly off center. In this case, the cue ball will strike the one ball slightly left of center. What will occur is that the cue ball will rebound off the one ball to this rail and then up table. At the same time, the one ball double kisses the cue and rebounds off of the rail it's near down to the bottom rail. Let's try the shot. I'm going to use bottom right hand English on the cue ball. <laughs> 